guys so today I am going to do a very simple makeup because every time I wear this makeup somebody asks me to do a video on it and I've never I'm like just like dust flying not even dust but like I don't know these things anyway um what was I saying oh yeah about the makeup so the makeup yeah it's um it's simple and the reason why I've never done a video on this before is because I feel like it's just so simple like it's just like wing liner and some lashes but I keep on getting requests to do this so this is what I will do and I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will talk to you guys later bye okay so I'm gonna start off with the Anastasia eyeshadow and I'm gonna start off with the color burnt orange so this is for Anastasia like I just said and um, yeah I'm just putting that on my crease like usual starting tips things so after I use the burnt orange I'm going to go back in with the same palette that I showed you before that palette is actually customized so you can't buy that specific palette you can make it but um, I kind of just picked the colors so after I do that, I'm going to go on to my eyeliner. So I'm just doing winged liner here. And this is L'Oreal's gel eyeliner. And I know I know this before, but I really like this gel eyeliner. And it's a drugstore eyeliner. So if you ever need a gel eyeliner, you should definitely pick this one up because it's actually really good. I love it. It's one of my faves. So here, I'm basically just trying to perfect that wing, of course. Get it as straight as I can and um, as clean and neat as I can. So if you're not an eyeliner pro, you could always just go back and clean up that wing with concealer. So now I'm just putting on lashes. So these are the same lashes that I've been wearing forever, MAC 35s, and I'm just putting those on with a tweezer looking down into the mirror. Now for skin, I am going to put on Strobe Cream. And you guys know I always put this on. This is just going to give you a glow. The reason why I put it all over my face is because I have very dry skin. So I like my skin to always be strobing. <laughs> if you do not have very, very dry skin, you probably would not want to put this all over your face. You would just want to put that in specific places on your face, not all over like I do. So for foundation, I am using Charlotte Tilbury Magic Foundation. So this foundation has a demi-matte finish. So it is a matte finish. It's not very much of a dewy finish, but it does give you um, some luminosity, although it is a matte foundation. It's a demi-matte. That's what they call it there at Charlotte. So yeah, that's just going to go all over my face. And now I'm going on to concealer. So for concealer, I'm using the same one that I always use, my Urban Decay. I love this product. It's still luminous. It doesn't dry up to be super matte because, you know, I don't really like anything too matte on my face because I am very dry. So um, I don't know what color this is. I know it's light, but once I put the powder on, it won't be so, so light. So that's what I'm using for concealer. I'm also highlighting the middle of my forehead and then blending it in with the Beauty Blender. And then after I blend this in with the Beauty Blender, I go back with my foundation brush and I kind of try, try to like um, blend it in because I feel like I always still have a mark. Like you can always see where the Beauty Blender was. So I'm going to go back and blend it with my foundation brush. And I'm sorry, my voice sounds weird. I'm very sick right now. I have a, like a cold, so I sound funny. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm just doing that, rubbing it in, trying to make it look as... Um, Lois as I can and then after this I'm going to just set my concealer very quickly with this powder and um, I use a sponge to kind of like pack it in and then I go back and I wipe it off but for um contour I'm going to use Charlotte Tilbury and this is her sculpting powder so that's what I'm using just something like quick and easy and I know I still have powder under my eye, like I said before, I go back and I wipe that off. I just don't put a ton because, like I said before, I am very dry, so I don't like to bake my face for too long. And then I'm going to use the color Smoke. This is also by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm just going to put that on my lower lash line and um, give it a little smoke and a little defineness. 
Now for my um, highlight, I'm going to use Anastasia also, and I'm going to use the Highlight Boli. I think that's my favorite one um, in this kit for me on my skin. That's the one that I prefer to wear. And um, yeah, I have this thing in my hair, and I cannot stop staring at it. It's driving me crazy. I wish I would have noticed. It's like really driving me crazy. I'm just staring at it. But anyways, um, yeah, for this blush, it's Laura Mercier. I think it's like Pink Lotus or something like that. It's really good blush, especially if you do bridal or, you know, prom. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous blush. And for a lip, I'm going to use Plum Lip Liner by MAC and Naked Liquid Lipstick by Anastasia also. I'm using a lot of Anastasia in this video. I did not even notice that until now. But yeah, um, so the Plum and the Naked look really good. The Naked is just like a nude lipstick. You guys probably could have guessed that. But um, I like the way it looks with the plum liner. I actually love the plum liner. It goes really nice with a lot of skin tones and it's always just fits so well with like nude lipsticks or like a mauve lipstick. It's a really good lip liner to have. So if you're at MAC, you should definitely pick that up. And then I'm just going to use ColourPop. I needed a little bit of shimmer in this look. You guys know I cannot help it. And yeah, this is called I Love This. I Heart This, I think, and it's from Color Pop. So yeah, guys, this is basically the end of the video, and um, I hope you enjoyed it. So let me know what you want to see next, because I need some ideas. I don't know if I should do, like, a favorite or something like that or what. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!